and sightseeing. Enjoy the day. Can I, can I offer you some uh, some blue milk, Kylo? Any blue milk? I don't think he's interested. Here we go. He's not a fan of it either. See? We're having a great day. Hey everybody, Ray360 here, back at Disneyland, May the 4th be with you. We're here to check out some of the Star Wars inspired treats, some latest updates, go on a few rides, right? Mm -hmm. And just have a great time, come with us, let's go. Here at Galaxy's Edge, the milk stand. Special for the May 4th seasonal offering, we've got the Blue Milk Moncala Swirl. It's essentially blue milk topped with, I believe, mango sour jellies and a mango gel. Let's check it out. That is, um, interesting. It's definitely sour and sweet, and the mango jelly gives it a little bit of texture. It's just weird. It's weird. Uh oh. Oh. Affirmative back to that sightseeing. Enjoy the day. Can I, can I offer you some uh, some blue milk, Kylo? Any blue milk? I don't think he's interested. Here we go. Kylo's not a fan either. That tells you something. Yeah, I was never a fan of the blue milk, actually. I'm I'm more team green milk. The green milk, that's my jam. This here, yeah, the green milk is your antidote. Yep. Cheers. Here in Smuggler's Run and Galaxy's Edge, ready to test whether a five-year-old could pilot the greatest ship in the sky. Let's go. I'm gonna fly the American Falcon. And it's gonna be so cool and safe. Then find the turn right. Right. Now let's go get that class Re out. That's left, Baba. Right, I said right. Make the jump to light speed. Ready? Let's go. Good job. <laughs> Baba, go right. Ah, it is. After that train. Follow the train, Baba. Flight engineers, fire the apple. Baba, go left. Shoot left. Cargo free. Left. Let the pilot breathe. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, my friend, that could have been much worse. Okay, it's much worse. Oh. <laughs> Shoot the train. The cargo is breaking free. Keep shooting. Too close. Gunship. Hit the 
booster bomb. Hit the booster. Oh, the oh. 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 Help! Woo! Let's get out of here! Ready? <laughs> he made it! It's on the steering wheel! <laughs> Great job, my friend! <laughs> 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 I dreamed one of the of Kobatia. This will greatly help the resistance. You have heard the first order and made Chewie proud! Woo! We went on a mountain fountain and we shot a mountain, went on white speed. We even got this white thing. And I really, really love how we shot the train. And we went left and right. Then we went on a different planet inside Earth and even inside the moon. And I really, really love it. And Never ever can I do this again. Yeah, let me tell you what really happened. You don't let a five-year-old pilot the Millennium Falcon. That's it. from Docking Bay 7 here for the May 4th menu. This is the Ishi Tip Pasta with Bantha Beef. Have you ever had Bantha before? I haven't, but let's dig into it. Oh yeah. So it's basically a pot roast cooked low and slow over a bed of pasta with a coconut curry sauce and mixed vegetables. The coconut curry gives it a, a distinct island flavor. A little bit of a kick, not much, just enough to make it interesting. But I've got to say, this is a very delightful dish. The meat is fork tender. It falls apart right in your mouth. The pasta's cooked well. And again, it's got that beautiful island flavor. This is super good. I can't get over this. This is pretty amazing. This thing definitely slaps. On a slap meter, I give it five Will Smiths. This thing is a must on any menu. And hopefully it sticks around past the May 4th holiday. And I also picked up the seasonal offering. This is a Vincian Mineral Mousse. Essentially a dark chocolate mousse with a banana brulee center, strawberry mousse, and vanilla chantilly. Atop a cookie crumble, I believe. Either way, let's get into it. All right, check that out. Let's see what this action is here. I believe that's the vanilla. That's the strawberry mousse, which would then make this the chocolate star of the show. Oh yeah. The mousse is really delicate, light, full of flavor, but just airy. It's the, uh, the banana and chocolate really complement each other. And then let's just get here a little bit of that vanilla and a little bit of that, a little bit of the strawberry and cookie crumble for that perfect bite. Oh yeah. This is another hit. Check out the docking bay before these items are gone. Definitely the Bantha Beef and the Vinci Mineral Mousse. Big hits, five Wolf Smiths. Let's go.
my friends? This here is the Olga's Obsession. Oh yeah. Sweet, but not terribly sweet. The boba inside, I guess it's blueberry flavored. Burst the tropical flavor. I like it. Very citrusy. Cool, it's a jello. Really great with the kids. Thumbs up. Some Mugan tea for you here. Very much like a horchata. Love it. Next up, the Java juice. A lot of pineapple flavor in this one. Actually, the pineapple is really overpowering. But it's got the blueberry boba in here too. Cute, fun, good for the gram. Awesome with the kids. And this last one is the Blurred Fire. It's kind of like a, um, almost like a berry flavor, but then the habanero lime kicks in. Not spicy at all, but it gives it a little subtle, subtle kick. This one's cool, this one's a win. And of course, the five blossom bread with the beer cheese dipping sauce. Let's give it a go. Soft pretzel, lightly salted, served warm. It's calling me, it's speaking to me. And with the cheese dipping sauce. Oh, I like it.
All right, I can't emphasize enough how good the Star Wars overlay is on Space Mountain. Hyperspace Mountain over the original, I would take that 10 out of 10 times. The experience is that legit. Now, take it from somebody who's dressed up like an intergalactic Flava Flav. Yeah, boy! Over here with my at, -at popcorn bucket, which is also a limited special edition item. Make sure you queue up for that one very early because that line is like a Black Friday line. You want to get there early as possible because these things also sell out. But again, back to Hyperspace Mountain, incredible ride. Love the Star Wars overlay. Keep it, Disney. Keep it for a long time. Cheers. All right, here at the Galactic Grill, got myself a key lime pie slush on a day like today, just what the doctor ordered, as well as a Star Wars themed parfait of Mustafar. Let's first try out the slushy. Oh, that is really good. It doesn't really taste that artificial. I was worried about artificial lime seasoning, but no, not at all. It's pretty delicate. I like it. And it comes with this little um, little key lime candy. Oh, perfect. I'm a sucker for citrus and a sucker for key lime. This hits the spot. Five little snacks. And not only is this an Instagrammable drink, it also comes with one of the glow cubes. Awesome for the kids, and especially for the Main Street Electrical Parade. But be forewarned, an incredible sugar rush will follow. And now, the parfait of Mustafar. Let's dig into this. It looks pretty menacing. Chocolate lava cake, red sponge cake, and apparently, I think, a chocolate mousse center. But it is incredibly difficult to penetrate. All right, here we go. Let's give it a go. It almost reminds me of the Cosmic Orb over by Tehran Treats, Guardians of the Galaxy. Except, actually, I prefer that one a little better than this. This is, um, it's not bad. It's almost like a, um, a Darth by Chocolate. A little too rich, a little too decadent. But if you want something a little more mellow, I believe the Cosmic Orb is actually a raspberry mousse. Eh, I give this three stars out of five. But if you're really into chocolate, then this might be for you. Well, that just about wraps up our coverage of the Star Wars Month of May festivities at Disneyland. From our perspective, it was an incredible time. Trying new foods, as well as the intergalactic treats, and of course, going on a few of our favorite rides. Thanks again for watching, and we hope you enjoyed our latest adventure. And if you liked this video, don't forget to hit that like button and consider subscribing for more updates and adventures. That's it for me, folks. I'm Ray360. Until next time, and may the Force be with you.